Okay, you know how the SP MK2 has the skip back feature? You know, where you could hit the button and whatever you were just messing with, recorded it to be there. The NPC does that too, you knew that? No, no, no. Uh, I did not know I that. I think I saw I something about cool. that on there. But um, I don't, the app, yeah, I don't yeah. use that feature. Yeah, it, it's dope. All you gotta do is after you mess around with the NPC, I, I'm actually gonna air a video right now. Okay, skip back feature like the SP404 MK2 on the NPC is called Retrospective Record. And, okay. But um, if you're just messing with your chops and you're like, damn, I wanna see what I just played, that, that sounded kinda dope, it's gonna be in that track view. Mm. Mm. And That's yeah, true. as long as you don't push nothing else and you can keep it. And if you don't wanna keep it, you just hit undo and it's gone. <laughs> That's yeah. it. I just know the tempo, or it just takes. It's really just uh, the exact playback of what you just did. Yeah, I wouldn't. I would like my brain wouldn't trigger on and be like, wait, go back. Mm. Just, just out of old, right old school habits, that. you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I, I, on that one time, it would be cool. But like, I mean, it's probably an audio buffer on the um, 404 and the NPC, but on the 404, it doesn't do that. Limit, the MIDI track part, though, right? It just drops the audio. Like when you re when you hit that button, yeah. skip back on the four four. It's right. like the audio of everything that happened. It's like it, it doesn't have to be I smart. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's why I don't think it. I don't think it will.